So this video is the first real true installment of my power phase protocol. And power is a word thrown around a lot in, in the athletic development world, but essentially by and large, it is just the rate of force production. How much force are you putting into the ground and how quickly you can elicit uh, bar speed. And in conjunction with the program I just, I just uh, transitioned from, the maximal strength phase, um, you, you'll really notice a lot of speed, uh, hip speed, um, limb velocity, all those things are going to come up. And I think a lot of times athletes delve too, or they prolong the power phase and, and skip over the intensification phase or, or skip through the hypertrophy phase. And, and enter right into the, you know, uh, cleans, the, the Olympic lift modalities, uh, the plyometrics. And, and I'm here to tell you that, that that's a mistake, that you have to allow yourself to adapt into a program that elicits different energy systems. Uh, hypertrophy training is, in, is, is, you know, essential. And I think uh, at the end of the day, the power phase is the finishing touch of any good strength program. So I want you to uh, you know, watch me learn and develop and make mistakes in some of the Olympic lifting and, uh, you know, journey through this, this new transition into um, sort of the, uh, the raw uh, purest of athletic modalities in the Olympic lifts. And I here to tell you, I'm, this is a disclaimer. I'm not an Olympic lifter. I've had the privilege of watching two Olympic games in, in Beijing and, um, uh, 2008, London in 2012, uh, live, the Olympic lifting. And, and I'm here to tell you, it's one of the greatest sports in the world. I'm no expert, but I see the pragmatism in it uh, from an athletic development perspective. So don't forget to uh, leave a comment and uh, maybe some suggestions and some advice. Uh, technically, that would be great. And uh, don't forget to give it a thumbs up if you like it. So thanks for watching. Bye. As I explained earlier in the intro, this is uh, sort of the introduction to lighter, faster movement. Um, I always start with squats. It's regardless of the day, um, I always start from the feet and work my way up the body. So that first exercise was actually kind of interesting. It's, it's a really light front squat with a band around my thighs to force myself to externally rotate. This is a first uh, set of overhead squats, pretty light. It's uh, 40 kilos. Uh, again, I'm really just trying to be stable in my torso, drive into the ground with my heels. Uh, as you see here, just a different angle of overhead squats. Um, I don't really prefer jerking the, the weight uh, from behind the head. It's, it's a little, uh, you know, hard on the shoulders, to be honest with you, but it's light enough to where, you know, I don't uh, feel like there's too much of a risk, but... Really uh, here, I'm just, just trying to stay tall. Uh, this is the first set of overhead squats with 60 kilos. And uh, it changes the torso angle a little bit, obviously. Um, a little taller, maybe a little more uh, sitting back, perhaps a little bit too far. So i got to keep uh, confident that I can push my torso a little bit more forward and stabilize with my shoulders overhead. Uh, but again, a real low... Real dynamic, driving through the ground and up. This is the first set of um, front squat to overhead press. Uh, I was just kind of getting adjusted. I'm, I'm still getting comfortable uh, with the bar mounted out in front. Uh, that's kind of a slow push. Uh, the jerk was a lot better. Um, I, I just prefer jerking versus a press. But on the next set here coming up, I do the same exact thing except I drive out of the hole a lot faster, and uh, the bar speed overhead is uh, considerably higher. Uh, the jerk, uh, I think, was better as well. Um, just a little more confident, I think, in the second set. This is a set of good mornings. Um, I'm just really working on recruiting through my middle back, um, you know, my rhomboids, my, uh, you know, supraspinatus and subscapula uh, are probably one of the weakest points in the, in the chain, posterior chain for me. This is the first set of uh, power cleans off the floor. Um, it is, uh, you know, it's just essentially just a hard pull extension and a catch. And um, 
this is, uh, you know, a pretty lightweight. I'm not, you know, really I'm not trying to, trying to get a, a real high number on the first day. It's, it's really just about bar speed and, 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 you know, a little comfortability, just kind of readapting into this protocol. Um, so as you see here, this is my first set of clean, uh, power clean to jerk. Uh, I'm still getting used to, to working overhead, so that'll come. Um, this is a little bit better set here, so I got my head through. I'm still kind of uh, working on full extension. Uh, again, that'll come. This is my first set of power cleans with 100 kilos. And, um, you know, the last set was, I guess, 80 kilos. But uh, I'm, I'm comfortable at this weight. The only challenge is, is that I'm not a whole uh, lot comfortable post... <laughs> Uh, or past two, uh, 100 kilos, so 220 pounds, I, I'm not real confident. So as you see here, this is a, a clean from the floor in slow motion. Um, not bad. That was probably m the better pull of the two lifts. This was just a single. Uh, but essentially, uh, I'm, you know, I'm, I feel real confident at 100 kilos. But you put a, you know, 205 kilos, or pardon me, 225 pounds, or like 102 kilos, uh, I'm not his confident, so I gotta continue to work up the ladder a little more. This is first set of uh, snatch and uh, pretty light. Uh, here we have uh, some weighted pull-ups with uh, a 10 kilo plate hanging uh, between the chains. So just uh, just trying to work th fast and through a full range. This is really where I'm getting my volume from. Some body weight exercises, and that's um, that's what I'll continue to do for a little while. I'll continue to do fast, active, um, moderately intense exercises in the Olympic modalities and then use body weight exercises to get the volume in, uh, weighted or otherwise. And I think these are, these are good options for that. Uh, if you can't control your own body weight, then, then you're in trouble. So anyhow, thanks for watching. Give me some advice. I'll appreciate that. Thanks. Self-destruct sequence activated.